what is up you guys it's your girl melly mel back again for another video hey y'all i feel like i haven't made a video in a long time that's because i've honestly just not been on a spending kick right now i literally have just been like i really don't need more body care i'm i'm really feeling like i want to just use up all the body care that i have so i can start completely over so I'm more focused now on using the products that I buy instead of buying more products. So it's a little shift here going on. So I'm going to think of some different content that I can still upload on here. That's me more me using the actual products. Um, yeah, but we're here today for a Ipsy reveal. Y'all, I have not did an Ipsy bag reveal in a couple of months. Um, I keep forgetting and when I do remember to check the mail and get this little bag I literally just open it up and call it a day I forget to actually record so bad me so let's see what the bag is actually giving Ooh, oh y'all can't see Ooh, look at this I love the black lips and the green to accent inside the mouth so pretty and the little um handle part right here is the actual little lipstick that's so cute i really like this bag this is really cute something for the spooky season i think i felt something else. oh yeah there is also a brush in here farah blender brush nice little brushy brush but definitely this bag is giving me life honey i really like this clutch i like the colors i like the concept really cute i like that so let's see what we got y'all Ooh, the pretty wicked okay fangs out lipstick on this month embrace the unconventional vampy lips rich shadows pitch black manis and you just might want some more Ooh, okay so cute so they have this little vampy theme going on everywhere no tricks here, just treats. Dig into your five new glam bag products. Okay. So yeah, as always, they give us the rundown of what the heck to expect in this bag. The first thing we have on here is the Sugar Cosmetics Plush Crush Cream Crayon in Bourbon Brie. We have a Gold Fadden MD Doctor, uh, Doctor Scrub Ruby Crystal Microderm Exfoliator. Golly, this will be a mouthful. Um, the Farrah Blender Brush 25E Rose Gold Collection. Ooh, handle is rose gold, so that's cute. And uh, the Basic Beauty Hot Cocoa Balm Eyeshadow Quad. And the Love Plus Craft Plus Beauty Gel Line Eyeline Pencil in Motor. So, first thing I pull out is the Sugar. Um, and this is that... Uh, Plush Crush Cream Crayon in Bourbon Brie. So let me take this uh, let me take this part off. Uh, 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 um. We don't play them games. Quick little wipe. Woo! Then wipe the dang top off. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. So boom. This is the crayon. So nice. So let me see. I think it's the blush crush. Mmm. I like this color. Bourbon Brie. I like this color. I don't usually wear um like color blushes like this. I'm trying to be all gentle, but it blends out really nicely. I usually just use powder blushes and call it a day. But that's not too bad. Um I might use it for other stuff like um under the eyeliner or something and set it with a um shadow i just don't see myself using this as an actual blush um a cream blush crayon um so yeah maybe even a lipstick or something you never know this is the loved plus i think it's a plus sign <laughs> love plus craft plus beauty gel uh, gel line eye pencil let's see that and this is the color motor yeah let me tell i was like wait let me make sure i got yep motor it says it on there so a quick little wipe down i love gel liners so i'm excited to see this pop off 
very pigmented very very pigmented i like how deep and black it is so that's cool a gel liner in the color motor from love plus craft plus beauty that's cool next we have our eyeshadow quad mm -hmm. so this is the basic beauty eyeshadow quad in the color hot cocoa mom we gonna open this up and see what it's about and give it the white down don't forget the wipe down y'all so there we go i love the packaging this color is so beautiful and basic beauty i love the color of this so let's see hot cocoa bomb i really love these shimmers this is like a great kind of neutral kind of palette i like that so i'll go over quick swatches this is from the first one Ooh, two from the front. Sorry for that. Ooh, now I take this one. I really want to see the shimmers. Ooh, I think that shimmer might be my favorite. I like that. And just for the heck of it, let's see what the matte is giving. very chalky <laughs> but it goes with the color range here so i'm not mad at it i like that okay for the shimmers like i said this one was my favorite one so i think i'm gonna use that one for a couple little looks that was cute i really like that and last but not least from my beautiful october ipsy bag we have this mouthful of a title the um, solution doctor scrub ruby crystal microderm exfoliator Let me wipe it down wipe it down real quick okay this is the bottle so you guys can see it um yeah from gold fat and md so a daily facial exfoliator that adds hydration and removes dead surface cells revealing brighter radiant healthier looking skin so this is just a face exfoliator which is cool you can always use extra um skincare going on i have a few scrubs that i like already um that i use on the daily so it'll be nice to give those a break and see what the newcomers can give so yeah there's the face scrub the eyeshadow quad in hot cocoa balm we got the gel line eye pencil and i really do love love how they come and the pigmentation of it like them how pigmented it was love that can't use that um we got the blush cream crayon from sugar and then this is the color bourbon brie and again, it comes in that crayon kind of form. Mike can use this. Mike can use this. There's that. And the Farrah Blending Brush 25E. And this is from the Rose Gold Collection. As you can tell by the handle and the writing. Oh, yeah. I already have so many brushes. That's why I keep uh, the ones that I don't use yet away. Just until I actually find the time to use them. But... Till then they're safe in their little package so these are my five ipsy items really excited to use honestly the gel pencil the most um it's blacky black and i like that and it's still spooky season so i can think of a few different things i could use this for so yeah and i don't think i have too many of these in my collection right now so it's nice to actually have one that i could use often and find new uses for so yeah and of course the beautiful bag i'm sorry i'm gushing over this bag because it's so beautiful i really like this and i really feel like i would put this in a purse <laughs> and do something with it because this is really 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 cute i really like this so yeah yeah that's my little um october ipsy bag reveal um let me guys know if you guys are still into ipsy i know there's so many other little uh monthly subscription beauty brands out there like boxy charm and all that stuff but i think ipsy is just really cute it's a little 12 dollar holla cute little um 
makeup products to try out or just to add to my collection it's just very simple for me it comes in and i get a cute little clutch that i can use uh any for anything else so i don't know for 12 bucks i like um ipsy's little setup every month um but let me know if you guys are into any beauty subscription boxes that happen every month um i may look into a different one maybe boxycharm i don't want to i feel like boxycharm is so I don't know. It's just, I don't know. Something just turns me off about BoxyCharm. I don't know. I have my own feelings about BoxyCharm, but I want to get into some other beauty subscription boxes. So drop down in the comments if you're into one that's not BoxyCharm or Ipsy and you enjoy it. Shoot, I might check it out. But yeah, I'll try to get more consistent on uploading these Ipsy um, bags reveals too. I'm not sure who even cares to watch these, but I enjoy showing what I'm adding to my collection, um, makeup wise, skincare wise, whatever. So I like to do, do them for me, if nothing else. <laughs> but yeah, try to be more consistent with these in the future. And yeah, like I said, I'm really just into using body care right now so much. So I'm just going to find a way that I could um, make videos about what I'm using. I see people do a lot of the empties videos on things that they're emptying out every month or every week or so. So I'll try to actually do something like that. Something that I'm like goal oriented on getting rid of so I could... Uh, empty it out and show you guys what I've been using so I'll think of things like that to um, start doing because I'm just feeling like I got too much stuff <laughs> I have too much stuff I have to keep finding places and buying other organizers and carts and stuff to hold the things that I got I'm just like okay I'm tired of buying extra stuff to hold the stuff I got let me just use up some of the stuff I got and make some room that way before I start buying more stuff so that's what's going on with that so yeah, you can look forward to things like that in the future, empties and me using body products and talking about them, whatever. So yeah, until the next video, you guys be good people out there and have a great day.